Hello there! So we all know Google has its setbacks regarding AI generation, but don't worry about that because right now, Google is making its comeback with its new AI generation tool called AI Image or ImageFX. Right now, this is gonna be the website, the main landing page if you may. This should be the one you're seeing also on your end. So basically with this one, let's get started with it. Simple sign in with your account. I suggest using a Google account for it to be smoothly processed. And also, also suggesting with you guys, use a Google Chrome browser. So it will not detect any browser, otherwise you will have a little bit of a hard time logging in, but nonetheless, you can still use it. So this is how it should look like inside, let me just go to it. So hello there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to use ImageFX, new Google Text to AI Image AI Generator. So this is the inside of the editing platform. On the left side, we have a very large search bar or prompt bar. So if you're familiar with other prompt bar, for example, you have Midjourney, you have Runway, they only have a very small prompt bar, right? That is the difference with this one. That's one point already for Google. It has a very large prompt bar. On the right side, you'll have the output. You can see the images on here. So let's have some fun. Let's try a very basic, let's just say, a girl in a forest. And then click on generate. So welcome back to the video. Here we have a girl in the forest. We only have one result with this one. And if we click on it right now, it's a pretty good image. So if you copy the prompt, you can copy it and use it in other creators, or you can use it still here and add some stuff. For example, you can copy the image and paste it anywhere you want. Of course, you can download it right there, the settings right here. But for now, regarding the settings, it only has the seed option. And with this one, I suggest do not touch this. If you're not really familiar with seed, this seed is specifically for this image only. And that being said, I have a video talking about seeds regarding with journey or AI generation. So please check it out. So you can also share it with your friends with that button right there. I think that is applicable for any social media platform. And that being said, you can choose abstract, bouquet, blue, orange, or any other filters there. By the way, guys, you can start over if you want to do this one more time. But the thing that curious me about Google Image or Google Effects is this one. If you drag down on the option, you'll have other choices. So these are suggestions from other creators or rather the AI itself. Let's try another one with this. Let me put in a dog or rather let's be more specific with this one. A purple dog surfing in the ocean like so and simply click on generate. So I'll get back to you once it's done. So welcome back to the video. This took quite faster than the first one, I think because we already did a generation the first one. So we have four images right now. And to be honest, they're quite good, especially this one right here. If you notice, if you hover your mouse inside each photo, you'll see the prompt itself. So this one, a purple dog surfing in the ocean. Same goes with this one and this one also. So that being said, let's have some fun here. Let's edit some more here. So let's try this one. A guy holding a sign with a text. And this one right say, hello. Simple as that. I want to do it simple as that. So click on generate right now. So welcome back to the video. So we have it right here. A guy holding a sign with a text, hello. We have two images right there. And of course, you can copy the image copy the prompt or simply download it right those button right there with no problem at all let's try a bit more specific let's do it right there let's try a photo of animated mario eating a burger i want to be more specific here try the limit of this ai let me put this on uppercase click on generate and i'll get back to you once it's here so welcome back to the video right now we have this three images if I'm not mistaken and actually the last one is the animated version and if you notice here we have this drop down or drop down arrow you can choose some suggested um props regarding this one let's try drawing with this and this one let's try 3d render if you notice we have video right there but this will take a lot of our time so for this one I'm gonna go for 3d render and let's fix this one I've typed in an extra M there. Let's try eating burger. I think with this, I'm going to stay at eating. 
and simply click on generate. So with this one, I want to show you how powerful this AI is. It not only helps you with your prompt, it gives out suggestions. And the best part of it, it's totally free. So by the way, guys, this is actually a new Google FX AI. And I'll get back to you once it's here. So welcome back to the video. So we have a very good looking Mario eating a burger right there. And I think we just hit the sweet spot. For this one, I'm going to download it as it is. And with no problem, I have it on my PC. It did not ask for any credit card info. It did not ask for any payment. That is totally free. If you want to check your previous images, you can click on this arrow. So you can check the other thing you have tried. By the way, guys, you can click on more right there to check or other check on the filters right there. For example, let's try this sci-fi. You can add it right there, highly detailed right there. So let me just click on generate with this one and see how powerful this AI is. I'll get back to you once it's here. So welcome back to the video. We have this prompt, a drawing of a 3D render Mario getting a burger with sci-fi and highly derailed part right there. So with this one, let's check the results. I think we have four. And I think the third one is the most perfect. Since we still have Mario, we have the 3D render. We have the burger, the sci-fi, and highly derailed. So one thing I want to suggest before I end this video is that fix the sentence as properly as you can. For example, rather than saying a drawing of a 3D rendered Mario, eating a burger, let's try doing on this side right there, a drawing, sci-fi style, like so. And then, give me a second here, comma, highly derailed, perfectly right there. But again, that would be by your own preference. So that being said, if you want to download this one, of course, click on download button. And you'll have it on your computer with no problem at all. And that being said, thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button and subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Goodbye for now.